Okay, so um, another Nabu episode. Uh, welcome to my geeky hobby. Today we are going to be um, trying to get an alternative to this uh, RS422 interface on Nabu so we can do some serial communication. We'll try to use a USB to TTL adapter um, to perform, um, to, you know, to implement this interface. Um, let me show you quickly what the plan is. So this is the schematic of Nabu and the guts inside. Um, we know that the, the RS422 interface is just a physical layer. So it's just the way the signals are uh, delivered to the connector at the back of the, of the computer. The actual interface and the communication is standard uh, serial communication. So uh, what we can do is we can tap um, our typical usual um, USB to TTL adapter. Um, I'm going to be using one of those boards, but um, you can use other types. All you really care about is the two signals, so the TX, the RX and the ground. So those three signals have to be uh, connected between this small adapter and NABU. Of course, we need to isolate. Um, we need to isolate especially this, um, this uh, receive signal because this can't be shared. Um, if we want to send signal out of our, um, our, out of our TTL to USB adapter, the signal is going to come from here into this uh, pin 20, it would clash with whatever this, um, this interface is sending. Uh, in the other direction, it's fine. We can share because this transmit signal can go into this unit here, but it can also go into, the, um, into this uh, TTL to USB adapter. Uh, but we definitely need to somehow is, uh, isolate, um, isolate this, this thing here. Um, you will see the way I'm doing it is a bit complicated, but in a way it's also simple because of the mechanical implementation of the way I do it mechanically. And um, you will see in a moment uh, what I mean by that. So this is very simple. That's what we need to do. Three wires, but the way I'm going to implement it is a little bit more complicated. So let me show you the, the parts list first. So I got a couple of things. Um, I've got... Um, a 40 pin socket, some pins. Um, this is sort of important. They need to be the type where they are very sharp on one end because this is gonna go inside the computer, inside NABU, and it's gonna go into one of the sockets and we don't wanna ruin the pins of the socket. So we want those things to be um, of the sharp uh, variety. Uh, you can get them on eBay or AliExpress. Uh, you know, I always have a stock of those. Um, so I have two of those. I have uh, this universal PCB, um, the TTL to USB adapter, uh, some additional um, headers, and some um, thin wire. I'm using just this um, uh, Kiner uh, wire. This was used for wire wrapping, by the way. Um, so let me uh, let me try to figure out how to do it. Or what's the best way to implement all of this stuff? Um, I'll probably speed up the process and later comment once uh, once it's almost done. So um, just uh, enjoy. And that should be that should be our adapter ready. So the idea is we remove the TR1863 out of Nabu. We insert this um, adapter, put the TR1863 inside. This will disconnect the TR1863 um, from NABU, from the receive and transmit signal only. And we'll reroute those two signals into our adapter. And we're doing it all according to this schematic. Yeah. So we just connected. First of all, we isolated pin 20 and pin 25 and we rerouted transmit from the adapter into receive of NABU and transmit from NABU into receive of the adapter. Of course, the actual, um, you know, mechanical implementation is, I'll leave it up to you. I've done it this way so that I have a nice, stable physical connection um, between, uh, between NABU and um, 
and my computer. So let me try to um, get this actually installed. One second. Okay, we're back at the Nabu. Let's um, let's get our adapter installed. So what I'll do is first gently remove the the 40 pin um, serial chip. I'm pretty sure there is a tool for that that I don't have. We'll put it to the side. We'll take our fancy USB cable slash adapter thingy. Install it here, like so. And lastly, install our chip. I mean, you could, if you want, double check that everything is um, is done correctly so cross check the pin out make sure that voltages are correct and that's exactly what I'm gonna do off camera before I start the computer but um, hopefully this will bring us the RS232 uh, well the USB connection USB to serial connection up and running so let me get that done and I'll bring you um, in front of the camera in a moment So as it's getting late, um, the actual testing of that serial interface is something that we'll leave uh, for, for the next episode. Um, so for now, I'm leaving you with this diagram. I'll put, I will publish this on my GitHub um, in, in one of the files so you can grab a copy. But this is your alternative to buying the, the RS422 uh, adapter um, you can implement. Uh, you can implement the uh, serial connectivity this way. So I hope you like this uh, video. Um, subscribe. There'll be more. Uh, obviously, we, we're going to test this interface and we're going to try to use it for something uh, useful. But, um, I'll see you on the next episode of um, playing with the Nabu computer. Thanks for joining. Bye.